Obviously, it's, it's a chance for us to get better and to work on the things that we've been working on um, throughout our practices for the past week. But I think everyone's feeling good. I think Derek and the coaching staff have done an amazing job of just sort of like preparing us and progressing us in, into the point of, of playing in this week's game. Is there anything that you guys are kind of focusing on going into tomorrow's game? Like anything you're kind of like looking at during, for it to happen during the game? Well, obviously you want to start to sort of work towards getting in sync with each other. Um, I think the offense that, that Derek is implementing, you know, it requires us to sort of think the game a little bit more than what we're potentially used to mm -hmm. um, because we're used to sets, we're used to structure um, in, in, on, in the offensive game. But now I think it's more of like a motion um, that we have to sort of prepare and um, what's what's the transition been like um, going from your old head coach to uh, Derek Fisher now um, running the team? Uh, it's, it's it's been a difference. Um, I've been in this league for 15 years and have have had over you know seven or eight coaches, but I haven't really had a coach like Derek in terms of understanding um, load management, but also having a framework that sort of builds and progresses you to the point of playing at a higher level. Um, so I'm really cool to see what what happens and what comes of this. Um, how has uh, not getting to the finals the last uh, last year after getting there the two previous years? How has that kind of motivated you guys going into um, preseason this year and training camp this year? Um, I'm not sure if, 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 if that you know sort of if, if is any motivation. I think we have a team to where we we know how to move on and we do move on. Obviously, winning it in 2016 is probably one of the best feelings ever. And then in 2017, we won four points in Game Five. That sort of stayed with us into the next season, but. But I think like last year, we didn't play how we wanted to play. We understand that. Um, so this is a new year. We have a new coach. We have a new system. Um, so all of that is going to take time, and that's our focus right now. Did you know at the end of the last season you were going to be coming back? Uh, yeah. 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 How, early, how early did you know that? Um, the moment we lost. Yeah? yeah. You did? Why? Um, you, it becomes a cycle, I think. Um, in 2016, you know, I, I joke about it, and I thought I was done. We want to go out on top and then we come back in 2017 and we lose about in game five. You don't want to go out like that and then last year just having the season that we had, it, I just know that we're better than what we should. Um, so just coming in, fresh faces, new coaches, new system. Um, you know you want to be a part of this. Last you won defensive player of the year two times in a row. Is it your mission to go for a third? No, it was never my intention to go for the first. You know, um, I'm, I'm a firm believer in that you go out, I go out and I do my job to the best of my ability and the fact that I you know, get their awards, okay, cool, it's an honor, but um, that's not the most important thing to me. Um, it's, it's going out and having fun with these women, but more importantly, when, um, and I, I think that's going to be a lot. I have one more. For yourself, personal growth, like, what do you want to gain more? 